What's up guys, Random Razor here with another random product review video for you guys today and today we'll be taking a quick look at the Canada Goose Arctic Down Mitts. So of course without further ado, let's check out these mitts, see what's so special about them and give you guys my quick in-depth review. Canada Goose is well known for their winter parkas, however they do also make some very nice and high quality winter accessories from gloves, mitts to scarves and hats. Today we'll be checking out Canada Goose's men's arctic down mitts and these are their top of the line mitts that do offer for the men's line. Mitts are certainly an excellent choice as in general, assuming all materials are the same, they are warmer than gloves and for that reason is because your fingers are together like this rather than separated on a pair of gloves, thus our heat energy is surrounded through all your fingertips together. The primary feature of these gloves is of course it's made of down insulation with a 600 fill power white goose down. The interior of the gloves here do feature this very nice soft microphone fiber lining which is soft to the touch and of course very comfortable when you have the gloves on. The outer shell of the glove features this nylon or polyester type material which is moisture resistant in addition to a waterproof breathable glove insert. The inner side of the glove features a durable polyethylene grip at the palm reinforced in high abrasion areas. And as you guys can already tell, the glove is extra long, which features a hard face fleece inner cuffs locking out the code. So Canada Goose did an excellent job at designing this mitt here. Basically, there's two main straps. You have your main strap here, which seals your uh, the wrist area from the rest of the glove. So if in case any wind or water or whatnot gets through your cuff here, or even the secondary strap here, which is very simple to use, this rubber portion here, just pull it. That seals it in place. The other one here, you pull that and releases it. So it's very simple to use, but triple layer protection in terms of trying to keep the cold air and all that stuff out. These mitts do come in a variety of different sizes, ranging from small to extra large. I got the small one here because my hands really aren't that big or maybe not as meaty. But anyways, here's a quick look at what it looks like. Slips in like so. And as you can see, it's a very length, uh, lengthy glove, sorry. And uh, in short, it's a good thing in terms of keeping warm, but might, might not be the most ideal thing as you may have trouble putting your coat over underneath this part here since it is a little bit bulky. In terms of comfort, as I mentioned earlier, that does feature a fleece line interior or microfiber line interior, which is very soft. And you can actually feel the uh, puffiness of these gloves thanks to the 600 fill power down, uh, which means it's basically kind of like having a duvet or I guess a Canada Goose jacket you could say over your uh, hands and wrist area. Overall guys, my first impressions on these mitts here is pr uh, pretty positive. Um, they're very comfortable in the hand, they feel very warm, especially since it's on inside right now, and they're definitely the best choice for those of you looking for one primary reason to get mitts, and that's obviously to keep your hands warm. Gloves are great, they're more versatile, however, they're just not as warm um, from my past experience. I did pick up the Canada Goose driving gloves uh, a couple years ago, and after about 20 minutes, a half an hour of shoveling snow outside, I found them to be a little bit chilly and tucking my fingers in, to, or in towards my palm to keep them uh, warm while I'm still outside. So hopefully these I won't have to do that because my fingers are all together in one place and the 600 fill power should certainly help. In terms of any cons or things I don't like about these mitts here, um, the only thing I could say is that they are a little bit bulky but that's obviously because of the extra protection and insulation that's uh, built within these uh, mitts. And the only other thing I could think about is that these mitts, unlike Canada Goose jackets, are made in, uh, or these ones are made in China versus where Canada Goose jackets are made in Canada. So for the price, a little bit disappointed that they're not made in Canada here, but Canada Goose did do their best to keep the quality up to par with the coats and these gloves certainly don't feel cheap. In conclusion guys, if you're looking for a set of mitts for this winter, you definitely can't go wrong with the Canada Goose Men's Arctic Down Mitts. Anyways, thanks for watching guys. Hope you all enjoyed the video and if you guys have any questions or comments about these mitts, ask me in the comment section there down below. Hit that like button as always helps me out and I'll see you on next video.